Were you dreaming about Nora? Mm, must be some kind of freaky, deaky nightmare. <laughs> Next time, you call your friend Nora. You call her, and she'll take care of all the nasty dreams. I like your pasty face, son. <laughs> Oh, oh. lemongrass. <laughs> Nora, this ain't your room. Get your ass out of here before you get your ass beat. <laughs> you look like a dude who likes to take it from the back. Hey, hey, what did I just say? Don't make me take your TV time away. Excuse me. Yes. So, uh, where are, where am I? Oh, you don't know. This Orlando, Florida, baby. We at the Hilton Garden Inn. <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Excuse me? Excuse me? Um, where are we exactly? The hallway. her paperwork. You probably filed it three minutes ago like you always do, Hilda Boo Boo. Hey! You have such a horrible attitude. Where are your slippers? Just wait right here. Her parents are coming to pick her up today, so can you please just like get all her things together? I'll do 15 minutes of work in about 30 seconds if you just give me a chance. No one wants to listen to you because you're always yelling. The more you chirp, the more I'm not gonna listen. Uh, Felicidad, your patient is running away as usual. Can you please get him? Joe, we got a code gray. We got a runner. Joe? Go, Joe, hey, Joe. Let's go. Come on, work off those donuts, honey. Cold gray, cold gray, get back here. What were you yapping about? Why do they always run away? They always run away. They got a lot of problems. Of course, they're running away from their no, problems. I, I just didn't know what to do with you. I, I can't keep enabling you. Put it down. You are scaring me. Do you hear me? You're scaring me. Stop it! The sooner you take care of it, the sooner I got it, Hilda. Keep your panties on. Don't get them twisted, okay? okay. You can see my panties. Oh, you so know I do, bro. You know I Goodbye. do. Thanks a lot. Bye. Die. We don't usually read you your rights, because this ain't prison, despite what anybody tells you. But since you decided to go all Shawshank on us, 
You're here under the New York State mandatory 72-hour hold. Got here yesterday, that's Wednesday, so that's Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Saturday? Well, technically, we don't release patients on weekends, so you're gonna have to wait till Monday. Are you serious? Do I look like I'm not serious? Isn't there somebody I could talk to? Therapists don't work Thursdays. I don't need a therapist. <laughs> what? Okay. I don't. I, I'm not crazy, all right? I realize by saying that it sounds like I am, but I'm not. Let's take a little walk down memory lane, shall we? Huh? Let's see here. There it is. All right. Can you see this okay? Good. It says when you arrived last night, you were agitated, unruly, belligerent. Ooh, that's a big word. You know what that would mean? It's not even my file. Oh, that's... no, honey. This is your file. No bueno. You ain't going anywhere. So that's it? Like, that's all you got for me right now? That's all I got. I got lots of Candy Crush to play. This is unbelievable. I, don't I at least get like a phone call? Like I said, this ain't prison. Please? Can I just? I'm, can I, I'm whoa, 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 Keep your hands to yourself, pretty boy. You can't hold me here against my will. That's so fucking fucked up. Okay, okay, okay. I've had it. And probably not legal. Oh, I don't hey, know how that's hey, legal. Hey, 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 no hey, fucking hey, way hey, that's hey. legal. Are you gonna get it together? This is my office. You're gonna show a little respect. You're not coming in here, dropping the f bomb, cursing and freaking out. All right? You're gonna wear some goddamn slipper socks and you're gonna behave for once in your privileged little life. Got it? And it was not just in the case of Stormy Daniels, but going back to the 2016 presidential race, when there were women who came forward with not claims of consensual affairs, but actual sexual misconduct against him, one of his defenses was, she's not attractive enough. I would have done that. She's not attractive enough. Are you trying to jump or get some fresh air? Oh, I was just, uh, there's a Whole Foods. Because you know they won't let you do either. Yeah. Wow, you were a lot less fun than when you got here yesterday. What is that? Maggie and Kelly! Maggie and Kelly! Oh, that's Nora. Kelly. She does that every time Megan Kelly comes on TV. Or just about any other white woman named Kelly. You know, we actually have the same taste in movies. Or at least she likes Lost in Translation. But I think that's just because of ScarJo's ass. How long have you been here? Um, like two weeks. Two weeks? Well, like 15 days. I mean, who's counting? It's not too bad. I'm catching up on a lot of reading. What did you do? To end up here. I mean... What did you do, you pretty white boy? I, I don't know. You don't know or you don't want to know? Okay. Um, well, while you ponder on that, I'm you dough. You like you dough, like cookie dough. <clears throat> I mean, not that it really matters, because everyone here thinks all Asian people are the same, which is how I ended up with this dude named Ang's lithium. True story. Whoa, that's messed up. Mm -hmm. And I'm only half Asian. Technically, I'm also half white, so. Hey, maybe I should start demanding respect around here like you. I'll get used to it. I think they'd have a separate ward. How do you mean? I don't know, I just... I don't think we belong in the same place as someone like that. I mean, she's like a stereotypical crazy homeless person or something. Oh. Oh, yeah, no, I get it. It's because she's black. No, no, I didn't say that. Yeah, no, you're like one of those, um, those white 
Greenwich Village liberals who like says they're woke because they went to the Women's March. I live in Chelsea. In King. What, I'm just saying that you're the one who's making assumptions. Oh, so you didn't go to the Women's March. I did, but what's wrong with you? Okay, look, we all have our scars here and some of us are just better at hiding them. Welcome to the Cuckoo Squad, Dick. Ah, just a minute, uh, sorry, whoa, hey. Hi. Hi. I'm Gigi. I'm pooping. Um. You, you don't need to cover your penis. I see penis all the time. Can I help you? I was wondering. Can I sit next to you? What, like now? In, in group. Uh, okay, I, I mean, what? I'm really lonely and you seem like a nice person. Not lonely like in a, in a sexual way. Um, Lonely, like, I need friends, platonic friends, uh, n not friends with benefits. I, I, I don't need your, I don't need your penis. That's good. You'll sit next to me in group then? Sounds great. G, Ong, Yu Eng, and Ku. So that's a no. Okay, Ko, K O O, comma, A N G, Ku, comma, A. Hun, 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 Hun with the salt. Hi. Excuse me. Are you Eng Ku? Excuse me. Excuse me. Are you Eng Ku? No. Excuse me. Yes. How come I didn't get apple, like an apple and a yogurt? Okay, right. So you have to place custom orders in advance. This is just so we serve everybody. And why am I literally the only person eating it? Right, like I just said, you have to place custom orders in advance. I mean, this is my first day. Can I just have Kukuma Ang's apple? Right, okay, just... wow. Hand, put in my hand, back in my hand, back in my hand. Thank you. The toxic masculine energy is incredibly threatening. So you just stop or I'm gonna call security. So you don't want that? No, I don't want your shit food. So Anku, are you, do you, you don't exist, that's fine. Sam, please stop playing risky music in the cafeteria. If you'd like to make a call. If you... If you... Jesus! What?
must be some kind of I'm really scared. scared. I'm scared too. Stop it. Nightmare. Stop. <laughs> Lewis. I'm supposed to take this. I'm not in the mood today, Lewis. Take that cinnamon toast crunch and crush it all up into a fine powder. Sprinkle it all over your cinnamon ass. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, I'm you nasty. Hey, I gotta go. I will call you back. Okay. Bye bye. Oh, yours, bro. Damn. Uh, does the phone work? Oh no, I was just talking dirty to myself. Yeah, it works. Just down line. God damn. thought at all about what you want to do when you get out of this place? What do you mean? This is Pop. Nice to meet you. Yes. How's my daughter doing? I don't think it's a great idea for you to move back in with Jeff and I. At least, not right away. Why not? Well, in the first place, it was never meant to be a long-term solution. I know that, obviously. Right, and it... so we were only ever really expecting for it to be a few weeks while you looked for your own place. Yeah, I mean, it literally had no time um, before training started, and... And then... And then I was a corporate slave for, like, 80 hours a week, so yeah, still no time. And then I quit, or... You were fired. Whatever. What was I supposed to do, move into a new apartment with no income? I just think now would be a good time to consider your other options. I'm not moving back in with mom and dad. No, God, no, <laughs> not suggesting that. Then what? I... What? There's a great place upstate called Sugar Hill. What the fuck is Sugar Hill? It is a longer term mental health care facility. Mariah Carey went there. Wait, sorry, are you, was that a joke? Is that a, are you joking? No, she really went there and it's very nice. It's nothing like this. It's clean, state of the art, and mom and dad have already agreed to pay for it. Wow, that's so incredibly generous of them. Be sure to thank them for me. They're, they're gonna pay for my, 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 Extended psych ward? Well, it's not cheap, Lois. Yeah, well, I'll send them a fucking postcard from me, Mariah Carey. Why don't you go ahead and take this opportunity to get the bipolar thing under control, okay? You're really gonna come in here and tell me that you would think I belong in here? I thought you were coming here to take me home. 
Wow, but no, apparently I'm, I'm too insane. No, I don't think you're insane. I think you're sick. I think you have an illness that you need to learn how to live with. What about when you were depressed, huh? You were too ashamed to see a therapist, so that was pretty much my job. I was your fucking therapist. I didn't send you away somewhere to be locked up. This is different. You are so full of shit. This has nothing to do with your concern for me. Stop trying to make your sound like it does. This is about you trying to look good in your fucking society world and projecting this image of perfection so whenever shit gets a little too real, you just sweep it under the rug. And Lewis, you came at me with a knife! What was I supposed to do, huh? Tell me! Hey! Tell me! Hey! This is not Jerry Springer. We don't do that here. I didn't come at you. No, Drew, I didn't. I, 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 I wouldn't hurt you. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. I'm so fucked up. I'm sorry. I, I don't know what happened. I'm really scared. How you doing, sport? I can't say that seriously. <laughs> Please, I'm really not in the mood right now. Oh. Well, too bad, because I have gifts. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It's one of the many perks of being mistaken for Ong. Can I come in now? Yeah, uh, can Kwame come in? Hey, just checking up on you, bro. You done crying? It's all good. Do not worry. Totally cool. Just don't let them see you. Yeah, they'll think you're crazier than you are. I am crazy. We're either crazy or you're boring. That's true. Um, if you feel like crying, just grab a book and pretend to read it. Is, is that why you're always reading? No, that's actually a really good book. Yo, let's play Hangman. No, no one wants to play Hangman. I want to play Hangman, you know? I love Hangman. Despite all the racial shit. There is no racial shit with Hangman, Kwame. Well, it certainly begs a lot of questions, like, who is this man? Why are we hanging him? It's just fishy, you know? No. Look, it's clearly invented by white people to keep us down, I'm just saying. Am I right, Lewis? I don't know. I'm super uncomfortable right now. Is it because you tried to stab your sister? Kwame, you can't just say that right now. What? Ain't nothing to be ashamed of. You're bipolar, right? Yeah. No, I don't know. Sounds about right. I'm type two, I guess. Mmm, lucky. Not even that crazy then. Well, then they gave me these meds that made it worse, I think. I don't remember a lot of stuff. Yeah, well, I'm type one. So when I'm up, I'm like. I hate that. Sorry. Stop. A little while back, uh, I was manic at an abortion rally. I somehow got hold of the megaphone and was yelling, my body, my choice. And then, to make matters worse, I got butt naked. <laughs> Made sense at the time. People were filming. You know, they say one of the only good things of a manic episode is you can't remember half the crazy shit you did. But uh, there's a YouTube video, yeah. so. It was weirdly hot. I was very turned on. Thank you. Appreciate it. Um, anyway, that's, that's the first time I ended up here. Oh, you've been here multiple times? We can't all afford Mariah Carey's rehab. Oh, you guys heard everything, huh? Yeah, you were screaming really loudly. Yeah. My people talk loud, huh? My people are insane. We we're do take up a lot of space. <laughs> okay. So everybody looks happy to be here today. How's everybody doing? Good. Okay. Tonight's session is a group therapy session. I want you to express whatever it is that you're going through right now. And just know that whatever you say or however you feel is not gonna leave this room. I just have one rule. 
And that one rule is, please, please, please do not speak unless you have Mr. Moose in hand, okay? So you might feel the need to respond, that's fine, but do not respond unless you have the moose in your hand. So, um, who wants to start? Nora, you didn't have such a great night last night. I'm sure you have a lot on your mind. You care to lead? Yeah. Sure. Today has been a very good day for Nora. God is smiling favorably upon me today. God hath sent me lots of, lots of, lots of juicy booty to behold on this day. I said booty. I'm talking prime, grade A, Caucasian ass. Ooh, Kelly Ripper all tied up on ABC. They even got Kelly Ann Conway looking fine, even though her face is melting. <laughs> I wonder what her pussy smell like. I bet she say lemongrass, but the first thing I do is go down on her, and that shit tastes like wet Labrador. <laughs> but Nora don't mind. That's, eat it. that's enough. That Strike four. <laughs> Give it to me. Give me the moose. Give me the moose. You know you want it. Give me you the moose. It. You could get it. I don't want to take the moose. It's clean. Nora just stuck it in her crotch. Can I just say that I really don't appreciate being objectified by Nora? I haven't told you guys about my dog. Her name's Oprah. Why are you laughing? It is beautiful. It's actually named after Oprah Winfrey. Whatever I say won't leave this room? Nothing. Can I leave this room? <laughs> a lot of people waiting for me to get out of here. And I don't feel ready. <sighs> Love me, Tati. You know. 